Welcome back, everybody. Raise the roof. Thank you for coming back and checking me out, checking my channel out again. I hope you guys out there crushing it. I hope you're paying attention to what you're putting in your body, being inspector gadget like me in the store. And if you're doing that, guys, you are on your way. And I just want to give a shout out to Tajira. Tajira, I appreciate you for doing great things for me. And also to Jalen for leaving a nice comment below. I appreciate you, Jalen. And also I appreciate all of you guys for coming back every week and checking my video out each week. I appreciate you guys. Um, so um, my last video, I talked about how animals were uh, being treated cruel and how they live in these pens and they can't even turn around. And so a bunch of them just jammed up together. And it's just really being treated cruel. I mean, can imagine, imagine being in a place confined like that. And you know, and just, just being tortured. Just imagine that. And so that's why I did my research and I stopped eating meat. That's why I choose not to eat meat. But um, since I've been not eating meat, I do feel so much better. I feel a lot better. And I used to love myself some meat now. Don't, don't get me wrong, I used to love meat. And um, I used to eat steak, and I used to eat chicken, not fried chicken, not fried chicken. I used to eat baked chicken now, baked chicken. But I had my share of fried chicken too, but baked chicken I liked a lot also. But, um, but then after doing all my research and saw what's happening or what's being done to these animals today, guys, I choose not to eat meat. So today, I'm going to share with you um, this Beyond Burger meat here that I eat. It's called a plant-based burger patty, and it's pretty good. Can you see it? And the red in it is uh, made with beef juice, beets juice, not beef juice. No, God, not beef juice. Beets, beets juice. That's what makes it red. So in a way, it tastes pretty good. It has that smoky taste and everything, and I really like it a lot. So today on my channel, what we're gonna do, guys, we're gonna make a bagel burger today. A bagel burger. So I got organic and non-GMO, and um, you can see that, organic, non-GMO. And if you can uh, find organic and non-GMO, guys, please try to find a non-GMO uh, plant, I mean, non-GMO verified. And it's not hard, guys, it's easy. Um, it's a, a lot of you probably saying that this stuff is very expensive, but believe me, I'm the one who always watching clearance and I'm watching sale. When I go shopping, I will look for clearance, sale. When I see those signs, that means buy, 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 especially when I'm looking, when I'm shopping. So anyway, we're going to make this um, burger today, this uh, bagel burger, and let's just get started because I'm hungry. I have not really had nothing to eat. So I'm like, oh God, I'm going to have to do my show because I am ready to chow down. I'm ready to eat. So I got my uh, bagel right here. So let me get me a little plate right quick for it. Got it right here. Right my hands. Okay, so anyway, I'm going to add my mustard. I like putting mustard and stuff on my bread. I don't know about you guys, but I'm just going to show you how good a plant-based burger can look and also how it can be without, you know, eating meat. Like I said, you know, those animals was tortured so much and it really broke my heart when I saw that. And, uh, and uh, I just say, you know what, I got to make a difference. I got to make a change and not really, you know, eat meat, especially the contaminated meat. So, Okay, so this is the uh, burger right here. It's already fried, and um, and um, also it looks like a burger. And guys, it does taste like a burger too. You see, and it's thick. It's thick. And even those big old house burgers. Remember, we used to make them back in the day from big old house burgers. But this has already come like this here. And um, see, I'm gonna break it. Look, it looks like meat. I actually. It's a Beyond Burger, plant-based burger. And um, I'm going to put my tomato, and I'm going to put onion. Oh, get it backwards. Can't forget my cheese. Put my cheese, tomato, my onion, and uh, I think I'm just going to dab a couple on top of uh, ketchup on top. Guys, I kid you not. In the summertime, I grill these burgers on the grill and it's delicious. You know, you really can't really tell that it's a plant-based diet. 
And you know, you have to really uh, make a decision to not eat meat. And I had to come across that decision not to make eat, not eat meat. So, you know, when you're ready, or if you have a heart felt like I did, and not want to eat meat, that's good. Because, you know, a lot of things are happening with this contaminated meat today. So, man, look at this burger. Ooh, maybe I put too much lettuce on it. Hey, not so much lettuce now. Okay, but I love lettuce, so that's why I put that big old piece on. So guys, look at this um, bag of burger. Cheese and everything on it. It's a bag of burger. And I'm gonna cut it. Let me cut it. And I'm hungry, so I can't wait to eat. I would say to myself, whoa, I hope this video don't be too long, because I'm ready to eat. <laughs> so here we go, guys. The bagel burger. Let me try it, see how it tastes. And I don't really know how it tastes, but I really just didn't have it with a bagel before. But let's see. Mmm. Oh my goodness. So good. So good, guys. Mm -hmm. So there you go. Go ahead and try this. You guys will be pleased. If you want to just try to maybe go to this side, not eat a meat. It's cool. There's a lot of Beyond Meat, Beyond Burgers. That's in the store right now. So, yeah, thank you for coming back. And like I said, just try it. Just try it. I'm pretty sure you like it. And if you like my show, and if you didn't like my show, please like and subscribe. Okay? I appreciate that. But thank you for coming back, guys. Hope you have a blessed week. Thank you for checking me out this week. And I'll see you next time. You have a blessed week. Bye. Peace out.